everyone, it's Haley. First of all, I want to say that I'm back. I'm so sorry. I've just been really busy. I know everyone always says that, but I really have. <laughs> so I'm back. I have a lot of new videos coming and I'm really excited. So let's get started with this one. This is just going to be my nail polish collection. Um, I'm somewhat new to the nail polish game. I have mostly OPI and Essie, those are my favorite brands, but I also really love China Glaze. I just don't have that many. Some of you have asked me questions about where you can get China Glaze. You can get China Glaze at Sally Beauty Supply Stores or um, Ulta. You can also order them offline. There may be other stores, I'm not sure. As far as OPI and Essie go, you can find um, a few colors here and there at your Target, at, of course, salons, hair salons often have, like, new collections of OPI and Essie, nail salons, of course, um, and you can also get them at Ulta as well. So, get started. I'm going to start by showing you, like, my nail hand care routine, and one of my favorite products of all is Burt's Bees Lemon Butter Cuticle Cream, and you can just get this at, um, seen it at CVS, I've seen it at the grocery store, and it's just like a butter, it's kind of um, like a waxy type thing, it smells oh, of lemon, and this is just really great to like smooth on your cuticles, whether it's in the day or at night, um, it can be a little greasy, so you just have to use a little bit. I also really love Neutrogena Hand Cream, and... Um, Aveda, this is the foot relief, but I also love hand relief, so. Anyway, nail polish, okay. Um, first we have Coney Island Cotton Candy, which is skin tone, peachish, nude color, it's somewhat sheer. I find that I more so like this, um, heavily coated, so I like, like, the true color of the polish, but I don't really like it as, like, a sheer color. Samoan Sand, this is a nude color, this is one of my favorites. Lincoln Park at Midnight, which is um, a dark purple. I like this for like toes. I don't, maybe in the winter for my hands, but toes. Let's see. Um, this is a really great like, um, what do we want to call this, like deep raspberry color, it's like magenta-y, but it has sort of red undertones, it's called Seduce Me, and this is by China Glaze. I honestly feel that China Glaze lasts the longest on my nails. Um, every nail polish is kind of different, like the formula, so sometimes, even if it's in the same brand, they apply differently, but I always seem to get good results with China Glaze. Another China Glaze is Up All Up All Night. This is a really pretty bluish color. Um, it has sort of like um, like a purplish sheen to it as well. It's really really pretty. I love this one. I also have Heaven by China Glaze, but I can't find it anywhere. It's like a whitish cream color. This is Dim Sum Plum, and this is OPI, and this is from the Hong Kong collection. And this is one of my favorite colors. Ruby Pumps by China Glaze. And this has, like, glitter sequins in it. Jade is the new black from the Hong Kong collection. And I actually haven't used this. This looks a lot more turquoise on the camera than it actually is. It's actually much more, much more green muted teal. The ever popular um, for Audrey, and I love this for my toes. And this formula um, stays on for a really long time. This is one of my favorites, and this is a Nicole by OPI, and this is the only Nicole I have, but I love it. And this is called Take a Powder Pink, and it's just a really pretty baby pink color. But this lasts a really long time and applies really well. Um, and I also really like the brush for some reason. I just really like it.
Then we have Fiji Ouija Fawn, which is like um, a brownish taupe color, and it is kind of nude and has like an, a sheen to it, so I wouldn't say it's like a matte or anything, it's kind of shimmery. And then we have Dolce Deleche. I don't know how to pronounce that, but this is a nude pink, nude rose, and this is pretty opaque, so um, it literally looks this color on your nails. One of my favorites, which I'm wearing now, is by Essie, and it's called BBF Best Boyfriend. And it's just um, this really pretty, like, nude natural color, but I like it more than I like, um, than I like the Coney Island Cotton Candy, because it, it just looks, it doesn't have any yellowish undertones, it has more of a pink undertone, and I don't know, I just really love this color. It is just super, super pretty and natural looking. Then we have Van de Gogh, which is from, this is Essie, and this is one of the most recent collections. I don't know if you can see these accurately. This is Need a Vacation by Essie, and this is one of my all-time favorite pinks, and I bought this because it was in a jar at OP, at um, Ulta called My uh, Favorite Pink, and it's because it's an awesome pink. I'm wearing this in the video I posted before this. I think that's like April favorites. But it's really pretty and just is really flattering especially to my skin tone. Um, next is Fiji and this is like very opaque baby white pink. Um, you can see that. This has the tendency to apply somewhat streaky. One of my favorite all-time pinks is High Maintenance by OPI. It's very sheer and very pretty. I've been loving this as well, Pandemonium Pink by OPI, and this is the um, Hong Kong collection. Peach Daiquiri I bought because of the subscriber. This, these aren't necessarily showing up true to color. Waltz is a very pretty sheer whitish color by Essie. Um, Looking for Love is an amazing purplish blue color from Essie. And this is the reason that I haven't bought like lilacism or any of those colors because I just love this color so much. It's more of a blue than a purple. But speaking of blues, I have Lapis of Luxury from Essie. Um, Chinchilli from Essie. Sweetheart, this is a really pretty um, whitish pink and it's kind of like Essie's Fiji, except this is less, this isn't very opaque, and this is very opaque. So this comes on more sheer. This is like the color you see on the bottle. And I have Well Red from Essie. I have three um, American Apparel Nail Lacquers in Passport Blue, Mont, Mont Royal or Mount Royal, and Dynasty. Then I have Marshmallow from Essie, which is more opaque than Waltz, and it um, is a white. I love this color from Shu Umora, Umera, and it doesn't have a name, but it's very pretty. Love this green. This is called Jumpin' Jade, and this is by Sally Hansen, and I love this. And I love that the brushes are so thick with these. So you have thick that is. Then in Coral Kisses, Sally Hansen in Green with Envy, and Sally Hansen in Quicksand. So that is my nail polish collection. Please let me know what your favorites are. For top coats, I use Essie's Good To Go or Seche Vite's um, Fast Drying Top Coat. Um, for base coats, I use Sephora by OPI. And I also use this Essie Sensitivity base coat because sometimes, like, my hands can have, like, allergy problems. Like, they react funny with some nail polishes. So, thank you so much for watching and sticking with me. And it's so good to see you guys, even though I don't really see you. But I've missed you. So please let me know what yours are, and I'll talk to you soon. Bye.